Welcome to a brand new iCraft video. In today's video on the iCraft SMP, we are working on our little bit here of a gingerbread house type build in the winter holiday village. So everything's going good so far. The first episode of us working on this, we kind of got like the basic framework down and stuff. Now we kind of got to get the actual roof and such done. So we're doing this as best we can. We're gonna try to like wrap it in snow or icing. I don't know, it depends how you want to interpret it, but because that, that's sort of what I'm thinking would happen. Like that's kind of how I've always done my gingerbread houses, you know? So I would think that's how you do it, but um, you'd totally be wrong about that. Could totally be wrong about that. Okay, now here we go. And let's just keep everything going. But we have to get the roof on this thing done. We also have to figure out Secret Santa. We're gonna need to figure that out. So we're gonna have to roll for a name in a little bit, but let's first get the roof done here. We'll have to do that in a little bit. So let's go ahead. We gotta get this thing worked on. As you can see, some people are already working on their Secret Santa things. I don't know what mine is, but I don't think I can go too big on it just because I'm super busy around the holidays. So I can't really go too big on the uh, gift, I guess. So whoever gets me, I'm sorry if your gift isn't as cool as everybody else's. Like, I understand, I, I just, I don't have the time. You know what I mean? Like, I'm a busy boy. I'm a busy boy, okay? So sometimes things are not gonna be the greatest for my Secret Santa recipient, but we'll figure it out. I'm really nervous for what I'm gonna get because I know people on iCraft, they like to troll me a little bit, so. My gift could totally be like a gag gift where I like die or something along those lines. Who knows? It could be something along those lines with these people. They're crazy. They like to troll me a lot, but it's okay because it's amazing and it's funny and it'll see. We'll see what happens. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I am wrong. I'm hoping I'm wrong, but we'll see what happens. All right, here we go. Yoink. And let's finish up this side here. This should be pretty good. This should look pretty pretty good too. we're almost done with the outer layer which the outer layer is clearly the hardest part of this is just swapping this dirt out for that because the rest is pretty much just filling it in which of course i can handle that like i'm not a noob you know what i mean like i got this so things gonna turn out great once it's done let's just do it this way this way is honestly faster i think where we actually set the like framing blocks down that should work a lot better, I'm pretty sure. Let's do it that way. Completed here for the roof. Now we kind of just got to actually figure out what we want to do for like the interior parts of this. I really don't know fully what I should go for. So I think we're going to just start with filling in each of these like this. I'm hoping we can get this to look pretty good. I've never really done a roof like this, so this is definitely a brand new experience and not one that I'm looking forward to because I'm not expecting this thing to turn out amazing. This is what happens when you wait till the last minute. You don't plan out your build at all is essentially what this would be. But, um, okay. So, so far looking okay, I guess. Right? I think this is working right now, or at least for now. So let's do that. Let's get all this connected here. And we'll get this one connected as well. Uh, this this side over here you should be able to handle relatively easily. Okay, there we go. And we'll do that. Line that right there. Go across, I guess. And we'll do the same here and the same here. Connect this down like a so. Bring this across. And we're just going to bring these all across. And see, again, no one will ever be on the roof in this thing. But I don't know. It's going to look weird, I think. But we'll see. We shall see, maybe it won't look that weird, who knows? And let's go ahead and just hope we can make a decent looking gingerbread house. You know what I mean? Like, okay, no, that's not supposed to be snow. That is supposed to be this, because we're gonna fill all this in like that. And then to make the transition between the two less weird, we're gonna throw snow there like that. I don't really want it to look really like weird with the two planks, like kind of like, mixing together almost if that makes sense like there's like no mixing it's just like instant so to fix that uh we'll throw some snow like that i guess i don't know we're gonna just make it work we're gonna make it work it should look okay it won't be the greatest maybe possibly who knows but it'll work 
And plus it makes the snow layer a little bit more full on the roof, which, not gonna lie, is definitely beneficial. Because uh, this is a little bit of like a less defined roof than most gingerbread houses would probably have. Because the roof is a critical part of a gingerbread house. If you've ever made one, you wouldn't know what I'm talking about. But, you know, you know what I'm saying. So now these here are actually going to be swapped back to that. And now there's all this snow in here. But we can clear that out pretty easily. That'll get cleared out, no problem. And that goes there. Yeah. Okay. And then out here we do this. Beautiful. Now let's get a, a bit of doors put on here. And I think we're gonna use dark oak doors just because they look like the most like chocolatey, like chocolate bar kind of. I don't know. We're kind of just working on what we got at this point. That's essentially what we've been doing though. Um, so let's see. We gotta figure out how we wanna do this. First, let's get rid of all this snow in here, but we gotta start decorating. Cause now the outside is kind of finished. I mean, we can always add some more some minor details and stuff, but it's kind of finished. It's looking like, okay, to be classified as the outside at least is finished. We'll get the inside started. We can always decorate it and add small details like in another episode or something. But let's go ahead and get the basics done here. First, we gotta figure out lighting. And I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna throw a beam of sea lanterns right there. And I'm hoping that's enough lighting. I don't know if it will be, but we can always double check that at a later date. But for now, let's go ahead. We gotta get, give me a dark oak planks as the slabs. Cause I wanna slab the ceiling here just so that way the roof and it's really like weird shape doesn't like kind of integrate into the design of the gingerbread house. Like I want it to be covered. So you can't tell that it's a hollow roof that I didn't fill in cause I'm not gonna spend all that dark oak wood fill that in there's just no real point in filling all this in like straight up I'm gonna be real there's no point in doing that so yeah let's do this and let us go ahead we're gonna get more planks we need to grab a bit more planks there we go looking not bad not bad at all go ahead and just keep everything going here looking really good this roof is about to be finished there we go so we got the basics done here not gonna lie now what we gotta do is we gotta kind of figure out this secret santa we gotta go ahead and roll the name so if you're partaking in secret santa and you're not a crafter for some reason uh turn off the video right here so you don't like you know have that spoiled. Now we gotta figure out where secret santa is uh secret santa is this way okay secret santa is this way let's go ahead and just keep doing it okay so we got a reindeer sleigh over here Secret Santa is over here. So if I recall, it's here. Let's see. Secret Santa. Yes. Okay. This is pretty cool. I like this. All right. Let's see. All right. The rule book. Let's see. Here we go. I craft Secret Santa 2018 rules. Only click the button once. If you get your own name, click the button again and put your name back in the dropper. Gifts will be open as a group on December 29th. You have until then to finish the gift. Gifts are not limited to what can fit in a chest. Don't spoil the sand until the gifts have been open. Or never tell. I don't care. Have fun and have. A happy merry winter holiday. Cool. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Okay. We got T Mac. Okay. Cool. I was just curious to see who the other options are. So that's going to be interesting. We got to figure out what we can get my boy T Mac. I don't know. So you guys got to let me know down in the comments what we should, you know, Secret Santa him like with, I guess. Okay. We'll have to figure that out. I don't really know. The problem is, like, I don't have a lot of time. So whatever we do, we kind of have to be kind of quick with it. So. I don't know what's a good thing to get. I'm sure, I'm sorry to you back in advance. Your gift might be really bad. <laughs> I don't know. We're gonna see what we can come up with though. So let me know in the comments if you guys have any ideas, but if you did enjoy today's iCraft video, make sure that like button and subscribe and I'll see you in another one where we're actually gonna be decorating the interior and such of this uh, gingerbread house. So I'll see you in another episode. Bye.